Hello everybody, Puzzle Pieces here with a new Nancy Drew game. It is the treasure in a royal tower, or in the royal tower. So basically, it's number four in the series, so let's just get right to it. Hi there, it's me, Nancy Drew. Hey, Nancy. Just in time for my latest mystery, treasure in Ooh, the royal that went by tower. quick. Choose your difficulty level to start off. If you're new to Junior. adventure game, <laughs> <clears throat> Dear George, so much for my Wisconsin ski vacation. I arrived here at Wickford Castle last night. Seems a little quiet, but... The mountain is completely shut down, and the surrounding roads are closed. I think I'm one of the few guests who made it to the castle at all. Hmm. Seriously, another plane flying by my window. This guy. He let me take his picture. This is his smile. <laughs> Oh, yes. Nope. For now. <laughs> For now, Nancy. Nancy, seriously, whenever you... Whenever you go somewhere, it's always going to be a... What is that sound? So another click and find. Sounds like it's cooking something. Alright. We're gonna look around our room. Ah, key card. That might be useful. What's in our drawer? Ah, that's important. So we are locker 301 with combination 517. Yep, I'm gonna get my little notepad out and we're gonna write that down. So locker number 310 and Code 517. Perfect. Okay. Nice. Thankfully, they left us a, a knife in our drawer just in case. We gotta go check out our luggage with our jeans. Oh, yeah, this is all about the castle. Ah, there we go. I was like, you could go in closer. Uh, inventor of chocolate milk, uh, dreamed of building a castle like no other. The project took seven years. Da -da 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 -da. You can read this all yourself. Uh, what to do while you're here? Oh. Da -da 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 Elevator sometime. Okay. Visit the library. Unfortunately, Marie Antoinette. So this is basically a game based on Marie Antoinette. Uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Devil's paintbrush. Nice. Uh, you're about to have an adventure. Especially if you're Nancy Drew. Or jeans and gap shirt. Okay, close the door. What do we got here? Nothing up here. We got some more clothes. Oh yeah, a few more of our clothes. Oh yes, this is the menu. Better than nut and broccoli surprise. Ugh. Something smoking chili dogs. All you can eat fried chicken drumsticks. Ugh. White cheddar ice cream log. Ugh. Chocolate mayhem. Honestly, two banana boat. Oh, banana land. I thought it said banana boat. <laughs> Okay, so we have that in our inventory. And this is our phone where we can call people and the timer. Ooh, what we got here? We got magazines and we got Sassy Detective, October edition. Okay, so this tells you about um, fingerprints. 
Okay, dusting. Uh, so when you brush a lay powder over a surface, the powder or dust will cling to the oil left by fingerprints, revealing the fingerprints. Uh, fingerprints will remain, uh, appear darker or lighter shades depending upon how much oil is present. So put two and two together and figure out how to uh, determine the uh, keypad access code. So if you saw the four fingerprints below, what order would you think? Okay, so basically they push harder at first, so... Oh wait, hold on. Uh, will the darkest finger be the f or, or the last? So then what is the code? So basically it's like, it's either it's the first or the last. So it's either uh, 1735 or 5371. But they find it in the next version. Okay, so I think that's everything. Yeah, I think that's just the bathroom over there. Okay, let's just take a look at our surroundings just to know where we, where our room is. Okay, so we're near here and near the picture of the pretty lady. So, so huge location. We're not at a mansion anymore. We're now at a castle. Something over here, I think. Castle. Oh, this is just um, advertisement. And cheese. Ah, a person. Hello, Miss Drew. Did you get squared away upstairs? Yeah. Yes, thanks, Mr. Egan. My room is charming, but I think there's something wrong with my radiator. It hisses, and there's a clanging noise, too. Would you mind checking it out for me? Sorry about that inconvenience, but you're just going to have to sit tight for a while. I'm the only one on duty while the owner's away. And around here, it seems like even if it ain't broke, it still needs fixing. <laughs> Last time I checked, there were only 24 hours in a day. And now to make matters worse, there have been a couple of incidents. Incidents? What kind of incidents? Someone vandalized our historic library. Oh, really no. Really turned the place upside down. The owner, Miss Lane... She's going to be pretty upset. Why would anyone want to vandalize the library? I have no idea. I straightened There's up candy in there before the checking yesterday and everything was fine. Now it looks like a bomb went off. Books everywhere and somebody hacked a big hole in one of the walls. Oh. I locked the place up and called the police, but who knows when they'll be able to get here. Oh yeah, because of the snowstorm. Uh, sure. The police? Was anything stolen? I can't tell, but somebody's definitely after something. What else has gone wrong? Well, this Professor Hotchkiss just called me in a terrible flat, saying our room's been robbed. I went up there, but she wouldn't open the door to talk about it. Wouldn't even tell me what was missing. So what she want me to do about it? Uh... Sounds like you're swamped, Mr. Egan. Is there any way I can help? Well... Hotchkiss has a pair of ski boots in the basement. Yeah. The Frenchman's been working on him for it, but he won't deliver him. Says he's a ski instructor, not a bellhop. <laughs> I hate to ask this, but if you could grab those boots and bring them up to her, it might smooth her feathers. Sure would smooth mine. Okay. okay. See ya, Mr. Egan. Goodbye. Yeah, I guess I'll deliver that later, or... Oh. Did Hotchkiss get her boots? Not yet, Mr. Egan. Hmm. That's a shame. Uh, okay. Okay. We'll we'll deliver that. Bye. We'll go and get her boots, and also probably meet a few people along the way. Look at things here. Okay, maybe not. Hey, a person. Hi, I'm Lisa. Did you hear what happened? Someone broke into the library and vandalized it. You have a very Dexter square head. <laughs> He's saying the culprit must be one of us in the castle. Can you believe it? Well, considering that we're the only ones here, then yeah. Yeah, Dexter just told me the library is a disaster area and that it's totally off limits. Too bad, huh? I'm dying to see what they did to it. Don't quote me on this, but I think Dexter has an extra key to the library somewhere around his desk. Really? I guess you've really got your finger on the pulse around here. Wow, Any that's an old saying. Any castle scandal I should know about? Oh, we got scandal, honey. <laughs> Professor Hotchkiss is claiming she's been robbed, for one thing. But the real scandal is downstairs. His name is 
Jacques Brunet. Oh, okay, yeah. What's the scandal with Jacques Brunet? Va va boom. Scandalous cuteness, of course. Didn't uh, you watch the last Winter Olympics? He's France's big cheese of skiing. Yeah, he holds the record for the 500 meter slalom, but he totally choked at the games. I guess he's washed up now, but at least his looks haven't gone down the tubes. Yet. <laughs> so who's Professor Hodgkiss? Oh my gosh! Wait till you hear this. What? Hotchkiss is this nutty old oh. woman <laughs> who's always typing and talking to herself in her room. Whoa, she's a little too excited about there, that. And I heard her screaming that her room had been robbed. You said she's a professor. Do you know what she teaches? I'm really not sure. She hmm. just kept wailing. My theory, my theory. I think she teaches history, <clears> or maybe a foreign language. I thought I heard a couple of French words pop out of her mouth. Okay. But don't quote me on that either. I only barely passed Spanish in high school. Habla Espanol? Hardly. <laughs> I'm just a humble photojournalist covering weird old mansions in the Midwest. Mm. And this place is one of the weirdest. Did you know Ezra Wickford, the original owner, shut himself away in here for like 50 oh, years? Oh, Ezra's a guy. I thought it was a girl. <laughs> uh... I wonder why he was so antisocial. Creepy, right? I mean... Did we stumble onto the set of As the Castle Turns or what? I think that's a well, you probably drama want to get or settled. something. I wonder what we're going to do with ourselves while we're all cooped up in this place. Go crazy, kill each other, who knows? I'll let you get back <laughs> to your magazine. Stay warm. Okay, so can we look at anything over here? Oh, books. Books are important. Major fixture, bleh, ooh, read stuff. <laughs> Major figures and events of the French Revolution. Huh. Mary Antoinette, born in Vienna, Austria. On uh, no, she was the youngest daughter. So yeah, history. Style. Da, 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 da. Turn the page for more info. Da, 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 da. And the guillotine. And then she was executed, and that's the guillotine. And so yeah. <laughs> That's how you read something quickly. <laughs> uh, is there anything else? Oh, nope. That's the same. Wait, is that the same book? Nope, different book. The Storming of the Bastille. Uh, why is this a revolution? No, sire was the reply. It's a revolution. And then you have Jean Le Bouff. Sorry. Uh, yeah, it is Jean Leboeuf. Okay. Um, da, 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 da. Attempt to escape from his stature and rooms by escaping the dread. General. Okay. War of 1812. Huh. I know about that war. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay. Anything else? Nope. I think that's it. We only got two books. Okay. So we need to find the basement. The basement? Oh, it's too dark. Ooh. Aha, uh -huh, we have found a basement. Of course, it's like, we want to explore the castle, but there's like nowhere to go. Huh. Ah, here we go. Hmm. Ah. A brush. I shall take that. Hmm. Jacques must be gone. Uh, 9 a.m. to 12 and then 2 to 5. Well, it's almost noon. Oh, hey, meaning he should be here. <laughs> Got a water cooler. Oh, I guess that's the elevator. Well, let's at least open our locker. Mm -hmm. ah, here we go. So it was one, or sorry, five. Five. One. Seven. Ooh, Jesus, alarm. Okay, so, uh, it's not working. 
So, we'll have to wait for Jacques to uh, fix our locker. I don't think we can look at anything else here. Oh, we can look at Jacques' locker. <laughs> Try it on, on Jacques' locker here. If this opens up, that'd be hilarious. No. Okay, token. And then that's going outside, but we can't go outside because it's storming. So, uh, all right. In the next video, we're going to uh, hopefully get our locker open, get the boots for Hotchkiss, and then meet Hotchkiss, hopefully. Uh, so, do stay tuned. This is Puzzle Pieces signing off.